Quite a variety of world events are covered in this episode. Intelligent discussion of XRP Ripple will ensue. Following John Dion's victory, Z Hook's contract will discuss the matter. Now that we've established that we're going to complete the migration that Polygon is going to perform, let's get into Bitcoin. $565.63 the market as a whole is in a state of crisis. In the last 24 hours, it has fallen 4.28%. Whereas the US dollar and its currency pair remain pegged to the dollar and Ethereum trades at 23.95. About $2 worth of XRP is now being traded at a mean lean 55 cents. A decline has occurred. The total market value of cryptocurrencies is still over $2 trillion, which is about where we want it to be at $2 trillion plus $1 billion and remains at 3.25%. I am taking action after we warned you. Yeah, I'm doing the purchase. The way this plays out is clear to me. And I know where the markets are going. Since we are still in the early part of the month, we can turn September from its usual red hue to green. There will be a monetary outlay likely to buy today. I already have a small amount of XRP on hand. A bar caught my eye. The last four years have seen a bear market, which is the result of doing nothing. I could absolutely buy additional H bars. Right now, it would be fantastic to expand my collection with H bars, which I haven't bought since before 2020. I need you to immediately flatten out my DCA. It is now my primary concern. I will inform you after I have completed it. However, I have not yet done so. You are aware, however, that the TLN Lux Lion token is used for staking, minting, and the release of all of our metaverse games. Within our ecosystem, the time is drawing near. You should get the Founders Edition right away because it will be listed on Monday, September 9th. Sure, I'm aware that they cost $24.75 each, and there aren't many left. You may be startled by the price, but there's more to come. Receive 100,000 bronze tokens along with an unlocked schedule, in addition to a Founders Minimalist on A. Metaverse plot of land and a deluxe list with 15 points that earns 15 times more XRP than someone without any. Even though 100,000 tokens are only worth 3 cents each right now, they will be worth 3 grand in no time. Then what becomes of the token? There's just one way this can go in my opinion because it's a transparent, fair launch and nobody owns the token. Reason being, according to elementary principles of physics, when there is no incentive to sell and an item becomes available that no one else can get their hands on, the only option is to pay a premium for it, but eventually this will be enough. The token will be live on the 9th, so you should probably get them on Sunday the 8th. We take credit cards, XRP, and breaking news. Massachusetts was won by John Dion by a wide margin. Hoped for an absurd landslide, but... Massachusetts failed to generate a significant number of votes. Here is the stuff that was there. John is absolutely thrilled by the 8,909 votes. This is just mind-blowing. He uploaded this video. You should see him do a little victory dance and walk thereafter. This is where it will play, I promise you. We should wait a little before moving forward. Because of the technical difficulties, it's possible that. We should take a short pause before moving forward. The crowd goes wild, but the refresh works every time. Please join me in celebrating the top flyer F with music, applause, and a little dance. He will be confronted by Elizabeth Warren. That is really exciting for me. Talk about it to find out what John has brought. John Dion deserves congratulations for this polygon. Instead of using their magic token, they'll be using poly. This is monumental because the cryptocurrency community as a whole needs John or someone like him to start shedding light on the U.S. economy's present situation in office, or at least in this discussion. According to token prices now, the United States Polygon is the second. Biggest layer. The long-awaited upgrade to the Ethereum-based network officially begins today, with the long-standing because of Matic's strong market presence and 3.6 billion token valuation. Many cryptocurrency investors will be immediately affected by the change if they possess Matic. Matic is the 28th largest cryptocurrency. It would be wise for you to investigate the means of acquiring the new tokens. This is a Polygon 2.0 to a certain degree. The article states that any network can employ the highly productive token Poly to acquire useful services. The network has a native token that can withstand any future challenges, which is great news for the community working toward this ambitious goal. This is especially true for major nodes in the Polygon network, such as the age layer. Currently, Polygon costs $389 or slightly less than 40 cents, just in case you were. Wondering, that works out to 38 cents. You may have heard about us recently. I will share my ideas after reading Ripple's brief blog post yesterday regarding his feelings regarding the FXRP ledger's incorporation of smart contracts. We can say that he was leisurely. Regarding that, I have no grudges against anyone. 
I apologize in advance if my lack of understanding has offended anyone. But I just do not understand what is going on. Smart contracts were first something that Ripple said they were against. The win for Wheat had ended. You are aware that Ripple assisted him in obtaining the funds. I'm uncertain about his level of anger regarding the fact that he built hooks onto his Z network, sold his Z token, and made a profit. Obviously, Ripple provided the necessary funding for this. He may be displeased that Ripple reversed its strategy and is now competing with Ripple, but healthy market competition is always good. People in the crypto world would have picked up your concept if it solved an issue or added functionality. Therefore, if you were the only one doing anything, it definitely wasn't a good one. Thus, it is reasonable to assume that he is worried about the competition from this perspective. He will still fall short of capturing the entire market share, even when up against a massive rival like Ripple. This feature for smart contract hooks may have been developed by other parties instead. In my view, it is highly encouraging that Ripple has been reinstated to the jury board. I am absolutely certain that this tweet is accurate, which is why I have placed it here. Take a moment to hear this. When Ripple initially rejected smart contracts, there was a lot of uproar and people went ballistic. What comes to mind is Ripple. The fact that they are being hesitant to deploy smart contracts is ridiculous. In the midst of widespread outrage, David Schwartz sat down and came up with a way to enable smart contracts, and now Ripple has given the green light to them. The wind had already blown over when he did it. The fact that Ripple has. Return to the J-Board has offended some and caused them to change their minds. Can I be correct? Companies change and decide throughout the time and they have the right to everyone is capable of doing this, therefore I don't know what's wrong. It has been incredibly useful, even though I am still confused about how it works. Therefore, David Schwartz came back and said, listen, we revisited the journal board and determined that this will yield excellent results. And the fact that this will be beneficial. This programmability is being introduced by the XRP ledger. Listen, he went on to say, I've come to believe that the XRP ledger can support smart contract proposals. I will read you the points as you can see. Along with Win and his Z network, Ripple is publishing smart contracts on the XRP ledger. After he laid out their thoughts, clearly having meetings to talk about this, they sat down. After discussing it, he said they came up with a safe and speedy solution. You may launch with this solution without putting transaction, pricing stability, or payment performance at serious risk. Additionally, this will serve as a foundation for future. All more powerful features should the need arise, that is, if the original idea is still valid and can't handle substantial real-world use cases with the first release, hopefully that dispels any notion that this is a work in progress. Hooks can be said to have already fulfilled all three of these. Requirements David glanced at the hooks he observed, but I'm still not persuaded it meets the first one. In its instead, two years of testing and research should go into something that could be put into action considerably more quickly while still meeting all three of the aforementioned criteria. It could be flawed, and he's now undergoing a transformation. Either that, or he's fixing a possible. Put into action considerably more quickly while still meeting all three of the aforementioned criteria. It could be flawed, and he's now undergoing a transformation. Either that, or he's fixing a possible. Problem before moving smart contracts on the XRP ledger, because healthy rivalry is essential for everyone, we should once again look at everything through the lens of competition. They were AOL's sole rival until they uh, refused to upgrade their product and went bankrupt. All this will do is encourage the two companies to keep pushing forward, try new things, and improve their current methods in order to make the best product possible. I don't perceive any issue with it.